How has Minnie changed since we saw her last? Um, I think over like the summer since the last series, Minnie has kind of towards the beginning of series six, we see her and she's definitely better in her skin. I think she's kind of found herself more, but then obviously throughout the series, she's kind of thrown massive dilemmas that she's never had to kind of deal with before that are massive and so scary. She's not quite sure how to react. So you see a kind of how she deals with that and maybe her kind of deterioration or maybe not. All in good time. What sort of things will she be facing this year? I think I think there's a, a lot plays on forbidden relationships in this year. So I think there's there's definitely sort of interactions with that. Uh, a lot of plays on that and then oh, I think a lot about uh, her family relationships about how they affect her and you kind of see um, the effect for instance her, her dad has on her which is something you haven't seen before with uh, Minnie that's never been sort of touched upon so I think that's a you kind of you kind of get a sense of how she got to become I guess uh, an insecure kind of hardened teenager and you kind of see her her desperate attempts to, to kind of get close with her father and you see how that relationship plays out. So we'll see more funny. of her insecurities. Well, I think I think you I think you definitely see a side a different side to Minnie because it's it's not I think this is stuff that she really deals with this year. It's kind of like it strips her down, and it's stuff that I don't if any teenager is faced with. I think it's a real kind of moment of realization and reflection on. I don't know. It's like it's like bringing it all down to the to the core of what should I do? Were you surprised by all the fans pulling for Minnie and Frankie to get together? Um, well, yes and no. I think everyone likes a bit of you know girl on girl sexual tension. God knows I do. Um, so uh, <laughs> I think I don't know. I, I think um, it makes sense because there's obviously there's there's tension there, and I think girls go through massive phases like that because. You know, it's it's kind of searching for yourself within someone else and searching like, you know, is it attraction? Is it sexual attraction? Is it more of a kind of admiration? So I think that was whole, I think people just want some good on girl on girl, to be honest with you. That's not why. So I wasn't that surprised, no. Has there anything you've been, been anything that you've been nervous about? Oh yeah, definitely, definitely, massively. I can't give obviously too much away, but there's been, there's going to be massive changes, especially to Min Minnie's character that are going to affect all of who she is and what she represents and who she thought she was and who she's going to be. So I think it's that development and being handed some, you know, a piece of paper that says this is what's going to happen to you is so like, because Minnie and you're the person, you know, everyone's character becomes so close, you're so intimate with your character because you, you've kind of helped create them along with the writers and the directors. So I think when you find something that's going to happen to your character, you feel you take it really to heart. So, uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm very nervous. I hope I do her justice. Do you th how do you think fans will respond to this series? Well, I can only hope they like it. I can only hope they like it. Um, I can only hope I deliver a good enough performance for those fans. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I, I hope, well, I'm hoping they'll respond well because I think Personally, I think it's a fantastic storyline and I couldn't really ask for anything better. I think it really shows family, a relationship, a personal kind of development. So I think it's really got everything it needs in one big bag.